season of the 23rd and by the prophetic teachings of the apostle general 31st December the man of God made us known about certain numbers of the year that we must watch before the number comes and after the number comes where we must watch them and this morning we are going to engage in prayer for even though we walk in them even though we walk through the shadow and death even though we walk through them we are not going to allow them to take charge over us but rather we are going to take possession of them and take charge over them hey. and today as you walk in the season Jesus. and in the time of 23 may no evil come your way by fire. and may no satanic agenda come your way Jesus. clap your hands and shout I escape I escape shout I escape I escape that is my prayer we are praying surely we are praying surely Isaiah 28 verse 18 Isaiah 28 the verse number 18 give me the new King James I'll lift up the prayer and then I'll come back to the message Bible of that same scripture Isaiah 28 the verse number 18 if you can project it thank you Holy Spirit right right on the screen and he said your covenant with death will be annulled and your agreement with the soul which is hell will not stand when over the overflowing scorch passes through he said then you will be tempted he said then you will be trampled down by it he said your covenant with death will not stand and even your agreement with hell shall be destroyed and this morning anybody that has made a covenant with death Fire. against royal house trouble hey. against the life of the believers Jesus. every agreement of hell Jesus. to take up your life fire. to squander your life fire. Fire. to draw you to hell fire. Fire. your family to hell Jesus. clap your hands and shout I escape, I escape. shout I escape. I escape shout 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 I escape I escape Every, this one in our prayer topic every covenant and agreement with death for our sake to draw us to hell before our time this morning by the superior power of the blood let the spirit of the Lord arrest that covenant Amen. in the name of Jesus. Jesus when I come back to the message you will understand but I want us to pray we are praying and cancelling every agreement and every covenant of death hanging over the church and hanging over our life in the judgment of death that has been passed in the spirit against any family and against any individual in the church today by the blood we cancel it and we acknowledge it we cancel. are you ready for prayer yes right and lift it. shout in the name of jesus in the name say of as jesus. i clap my hands i, clap my hands. I, declare, I declare every form, every form of, agreement of agreement of death, of death hanging over, over my, life, my life my family, my family. say as i clap, as I clap I can't sell it. 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 By the blood. Every agreement of death hanging over my life. Say by the blood. I can't sell it. I can't sell it. I can't sell it. Clap your hands. Begin to cancel. By fire. We are dealing with the covenant of death. Bible says they have made a covenant with death. Oh my God. Any agreement. Of death, of death, of our life, over, life, over the church, over the church, royal house, royal house hanging over, over our, our families, our, family, our loved ones. Our loved say by the blood, we cancel it. By the blood, we cancel it. Clap your hands, clap your hands. This morning, you will never become a victim of death. Your family must not become a victim of the covenant of death. By the blood, we cancel it. We cancel it. We cancel it. By the blood. Clap your hands. Royal house. We are in prayer. Royal house. We are dipping the church in the blood. And today, the atmosphere of death must be turned by the blood. Oh my God. Sudden death. Sudden calamity. By the blood. We overturn. We overturn. We cancel it. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. You can come to the altar. To the altar. Engage the altar. The altar. 
prayer. We are raising an incense for the church, for the family, for your house, against the covenant of death. Of God, my family, must be exempted. My house, must be exempted. Oh my God, the evil news, bad news, the news of death, calamity, for the blood. We cancel it. We cancel it. We cancel it. Clap your hands. Sister, Atiaba, the Palaba, who are called by my name, who are called as them, and pray by the Lord. I will hear their prayer. Oh my God, deliver us from evil. Deliver us from the covenant of death. Deliver the church. Deliver the money. The pastor. The mercy. This terror. Our students. By the power of the blood. We are dealing with the power. We are in the killing with the power behind it. We are killing with the authority behind it. And the killing behind it. We are power behind it. We are simmer by a fire in the prayer. By fire. 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 Oh my God. We are spirit of death. That is the of our families. Tonight, this morning, my God, clap your hands, God to send us, 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 they have a covenant with them, the body, and the son, and the other, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, we counsel, 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 by fire. By fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, the devil, the devil, and it's a flea. This morning, we will chase any attempt of the enemy to the church, to the church. We will sit there, we will sit there, by fire, by fire, we will sit there, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire. By fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, a prayer, deliver us, deliver us, a prayer, 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 a over our children, where they clap by fire, let it let it let it let let Bakume, let let your voice lift it. Clap your hands in prayer. We are dealing with the spirit of death. We are dealing with the stronghold. We are dealing with the power against the church by the power of the blood. Clap your hands. It is working. Clap your hands. We are dealing with the stronghold. We are dealing with the power. Press up, in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost this morning. Are you clapping your hands? I feel fire in the building. He come against every attack of devil against the soul of the church. We declare by the reason of the power of the blood. Let the altar fight. We fight against every spirit of devil assigned to swallow every member of the church. Every soul we declare today by the power of the Brother and Bible said, uh, You are clapping off now. Uh, it's a weapon. Uh, clap your hands uh, and dwell out. Uh, clap your hands uh, and cry out. Uh, today, we declare fire. We declare war against uh, every spirit uh, of death. Uh, a runner, uh, the life uh, of the member uh, of the church. Uh, we declare today by the efficacy uh, of the blood. Uh, and today, Bible said uh, there is uh, a victory uh, in the power of the blood. Uh, and I declare victory uh, over the church. Uh, we declare victory. Uh, you will not die. Bible said uh, you shall live uh, and declare every good thing. Uh, tonight, uh, we tremble upon uh, every day. 
forever. We declare by fire, by the resin of the power of the blood. Today, are you praying now? Cry out, lift up all in warfare. Bible said, as soon as I was traveling, she brought water. And tonight, you are traveling in prayer. You are crying in prayer. You will not die. You shall live and declare. You will not die by the power of the blood. Lift up heart. Adikapandi and they say, clap your hands, open up your mouth, pray a prayer. Adi yakapa, rendi yakapanda dasikedi, roko toka pandi yanda dada basadi, arandi yakapanda dabasadi. For the Bible said we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against powers, wickedness in high places. Principalities, come on, Royal House, Sunday morning, 23rd, we are in warfare. We come against the cause of death, and we come against any covenant that is enacted in the house. We come against any plot that is enacted in the house. We come against any association of destruction. Madika Panda, Arandia Kapanda Kadiana, in the name of Jesus Christ. Are you clapping your hands? Are you angry in the spirit? Your children will not die. Anything that is planted in your path to cause death, whether business, health, finance, in your life, in the name of Jesus Christ, we are bought by the blood. Piwano, Piwano, Bowen. Seven up on fire and then on a pair of war up on the Biara and she say, Biara upon Biara. They ask the show of your the Equa Juma, the Equa Warrior, the Eddie Alien Nama, the Eddie of War and Nama, the Eddie of Sayan Nama, and we are so Christian evil and then you are my Pavan and the We are in prayer, we are in warfare, we are angry in the spirit. We will not die, but we will live and declare the goodness of the Lord. Your family will not die. Your children will not fall prey to the plan and the plotting of the enemy. Hey, a power na ubu ye, uja o ye de power zama. And then na uye, come on. The enemy comes to steal, to kill, and to destroy. A body a kapanda da si ya. A reke kapanda da da bada. Anyone planted in your path, whether you're flying, your mother, your father, we don't care. Whoever they are, we don't care. As long as they want evil. Let evil fall on them in the name of Jesus Christ. Are you praying somebody? Are you angry enough somebody? Open up your mouth. The enemy is in Aurora. The enemy is in Persia. The enemy is ready to destroy. Come on now, fire the prayer. Pray. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. And wherever you are standing, lift up your voice out and begin to pray against the spirit out of death out this morning out in the spirit of death out that you have covenanted with out that the family has covenanted with out to take away the young ones out to break the young ones out to defeat the young ones out clap your hands out on this altar of mercy out you are praying out for deliverance out for your house out you are declaring out deliverance out for your house out for your family out oh devil where is your power where is thy strength out this morning out we break the power of death out over our life out in the covenant out in the demonic covenant out that has been signed out aye palia kapos out e paleko sant out ra palia kapos we break the covenant out we defeat them out we stop upon them out in the name of jesus out we overrule out we overturn out we overrule out we overturn out in the name of jesus out. in the demonic covenant out in the satanic covenant out we declare them out now and forward we declare them out now and forward out in the name of jesus out. your children will not die aye palia kusaya in palatabah your children they will not die. Your spouse will not die. Your business will not die. Your children will not die. You 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 will not die. When they come out knocking at your door, the altar will speak out in the name of Jesus. Pray. pray. Lift your voice and pray in the name of Jesus. 
Go ahead, put your hands together for Jesus. Please give me the same scripture in message. In the message Bible. Give me the same scripture in the message Bible. I want us to look at the word covenant in the message Bible. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. As I was preparing this dawn, then it came to me. It came to me. Just yesterday, we were at a wedding in Aifie. Then a daughter of the house called me. She is at another assembly of royal house. Then she called me. It's a man of God, pray for me. I said, why do you need my prayers? So actually, she called me on Thursday. But yesterday was a confirmation of the call she did on Thursday. And he said, what is the problem? Mommy, this daughter of Zion, she's just preparing to marry. It's about two months to her wedding. She's preparing to marry. The husband works in prisons. She, the lady, also works in prisons. On Thursday, she called me. And he said, man of God, this is what has happened. 10 p.m., my husband was down in the office. So he was rushing home on a motorbike. Then he collided with another motorbike. Then they flew off the motorbike. And then he fell and then the head hit the ground. Mommy, indeed, it was an accident. That could have led to death. But this is what the daughter of Zion said. He said, after the accident, nobody came around the accident scene until 12 p.m., 12 a.m. in the night. Before a stranger, a good Samaritan, a taxi driver, was just passing by. And then saw them lying down. He said, oh, what is happening here? Let me just help them quickly and rush them to the hospital. Mommy, 10 p.m. to 12 p.m., two hours delay. Two hours after the accident. So my, then my question was, if the guy who had the accident had a good Samaritan the moment they collided with, the, with, with themselves at that very spot, I am sure somewhere, somewhere or the other, the guy would have been saved. But after two hours, internal bleeding, bleeding in the, in the head, blood coming through the nose, the ears, the mouth, he survived somewhere or the other, and then they rushed him to the hospital. That was when they took the ID and they realized he was a prison officer. Then they called their office. Then they rushed in. Then they rushed in. When they came, ladies and gentlemen, there was no oxygen in the hospital to look after the man. They had to call for another hospital. When they called, there was no ambulance. Jesus. Then on Saturday, the lady called me, the man of God, my husband to be. He's gone with the Lord. Somebody shout insurance. That is my scripture. He said, then you will see that your precious life insurance, that is the word covenant. So they have ensured their life by exchanging your life. So their insurance lies in your death. The moment you die, they live. They are covenant with death. This morning, anybody that has ensured life by exchanging your life with their life, today let that insurance that they rely on be turned upon their head oh i just miss the child i just miss you listen bible said they have ensured their life by taking your life so if you lose your life they will gain their life but this morning we are praying and the body that has taken insurance insurance in my family insurance over the life of my children and over the life of my house so that they will live and I will lose my precious ones. Today we are overturning the tables. And we are declaring, let their insurance be destroyed in the blood. And let the blood destroy their insurance. Somebody shall fire. Write a little. A declaration that we are. Say in the name of Jesus. I want to hear the church. Say I declare. By the blood of Jesus. Say I decree. Every insurance that anybody has taken in my existence to exchange my life for death so that they will live. Say as I clap, I overturn it. I overturn it. I overturn it. Clap your hands. Overturn it. Overturn it. They have the shield their life for your sake. But this morning, by the blood, we disallow. We disallow. We disallow. Open your mouth. Clap your hands. Two minutes prayer. Over ten it, clap your hands. We are dealing with it. We are dealing with it. Open fire, open fire, clap your hands. Pray. 
Lift up your voice, clap your hands in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus. Apeli Matosa, who can fire? Come on, clap your hands. You are dealing with the insurance of death right now by the power of the blood. This morning we invoke the power of the blood and the insurance of death. Anybody has prayed over your life, over the righteous, over the innocent, over every member of the church. This morning we stand in the power of the blood. We are now in the name of Jesus. We overturn, we override, we overrule by the power of the Holy Ghost and by the power of the blood. Don't keep quiet. You are coming against the agreement of death, the covenant of death over your life, over your business, over your marriage. Don't stand there. Clap those hands. Come on, invoke the blood. Let me see you clapping. Let me see you clapping. When death is coming, it will not inform you. So when you are praying, you don't have to inform them. Lift those hands. Lift up your voice. It is warfare. Come on, clap your hands. We are in prayer. We are in warfare. Prayer is the answer. Prayer is the solution. Bible said, shall a nation be born in one day? Soon as Zion traveled, come on, travel. Your answer is coming. You are bringing forth by the power of the blood, by the power of the Holy Ghost. This morning, you are declaring, let the power that raised Jesus from the dead overturn every power of death, every source of death by fire, by the blood. Go ahead, go ahead. Ilama Koshantaka. That is fire in the building. That is power in the building. Somebody clap your hands. Don't get tired. The Bible said, For the Lord is my strength and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? For the Lord is the strength of my life. Whom shall I be afraid? This morning we are declaring in the exchange over your life, over your children, over your family. Over your business, somebody engage in prayer and defy your body, and defy your soul, and defy your spirit. The church is in prayer, it's time to will. The Bible said, Shall the prey be taken from the captain, not the lawful captain, be delivered this morning by the blood on the account of the blood? Deliverance is coming to your family, to your children, to your house in Makosa. Basunaba, Maruni Mika, Ikadosa, the Bible said, and you also, because of the blood of thy covenant, I will deliver, I will deliver, I will deliver this morning. Clap your hands, I shall clap, I see fire, I shall clap, I see deliverance, I shall clap, lift your voice, pray for the weapons of our faith. They are not cut out, they are not cut out, they are not cut out. Fire the prayer, pray. Shout Jesus! Let me hear your Jesus. Shout Jesus! Said at the mention of the name Jesus, every knee bows and every tongue confess. Today, let every insurance they have insured their life. They have insured, they have bought insurance policy for their life by exchanging your life with their lives. But today, let their investment they have made in that policy be overturned and be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Listen, as the worship is going on, you want to pick a sacrifice and then engage the altar and make sure that if they have buying a policy with your sacrifice, you are also buying a policy. You are also buying an insurance policy on the altar of God for your life and from your family in the name of Jesus. Let a believer rejoice in the Lord and give the Lord a praise and a clap offering in the house. Go ahead and celebrate Jesus. Amen. Amen. Please close your eyes and lift up your two hands. Thank you, Jesus. We bless you, Jesus.
Jesus. You are worthy, Lord. Come on, if it's worthy, lift up your voice. You are worthy, Lord. Come on, invoke the covenant name. Say Yahweh. You are worthy. Come on. Father, you are worthy of my praise. Oh, 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 you are worthy of my praise. Today is the 23rd. Reverend Samson. Today is the 23rd. And now, and unless you are a stranger in this land, you know what the 23rd means. I just saw your woman here with you. Hey, I will see her no. And I want to say, sir, and they, and they pray you will We are fighting battles that our naked eyes cannot see. We are fighting things that are not human beings. They are not flesh. Apostle Paul calls them principalities. Apostle Paul from said, powers. To me, rulers of darkness. And wickedness in high places, high PhD in wickedness. But the assurance that we have is in the blood of Jesus. And I prophesy over your life that the blood will speak for you on the 23rd of April, from now to the 23rd of May, the blood will continually speak. Who am I prophesying to? I am. Oh, I feel like I'm prophesying to myself. Any plan of the enemy against your life, any arrow that has been shot into your household, may it be aborted by the blood. So they say the blood. The blood. Say the blood. 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 The Every Wickedness in high places. On Friday, we started dealing with them. Through the spirit of Balaam. Balaam Balaam was a prophet. Who had been hired to curse the people of God? Jesus. Bela be a consignia Yakofano, Etianica, say on bed to me a radema. And the Lord appeared to him and said, You will not curse them, rather, you shall bless them. Yes. And then Radiyin, where did you say, Oh, oh, God, you may be mad at me. Then we will be sit down. See the aftermath in Numbers chapter 23, verse 21. Numbers 23, 21. If you can just separate. Yourself a bit so that they can see the screen. Please start with me. Start with me. Most women do so at night. It's your new answer. And tomorrow, you're your new back home. And you're not our home. Shall we read together with a loud voice? Ready, go. He has not observed iniquity in Jacob, nor has he seen wickedness in Israel. The Lord is God is with him, and the shout of a king is among them. I can hear only Reverend Jacob's voice in this big oil dome. If you are here together, loud voice, ready, go. He has not observed iniquity in Jacob, nor has he seen wickedness in Israel. The Lord God is with him, and the shout of a king is among them. This man, God, will be with you. I receive it. The God of the Apostle General will go ahead of you. I receive it. Any calamity and disaster Jesus. that is waiting for you on the way, Scatter. may it be aborted. Yes. Because the Lord is.
is with you. Yes. So they say the Lord is with me. The Lord is with say me. Say God is with me. God is with the me. The God of this altar. The God of this altar. The God of some country. The God of some country. He is with me. He is with me. Nemo, I rest my woman is there. A radio with Nemo Pono. A forum case, a radino. Grantiak and Yamino, and no better than a And the shout of a king is among them. Amen. Now, he didn't get Yamu, and so our woman term. Give this to me in NLT. The NLT will break down all the, the big words. Yefan, why am not here? No misfortune is in his plan for the royals. Amen. Hey. Amen. No trouble is in store for the sons and daughters of the Apostle Jesus. We receive it. And it's only because of one reason. Jesus. For the Lord, their God is with them. Amen. And not only that, he has been proclaimed as their king. Amen. Can I give you a secret? Yeah. One of the secrets to survive the number 23 is the blood. Amen. Someone say the blood. The, the blood. blood. And we shall be celebrating the blood today. Amen. But another reason or another key is to proclaim God as your king. Yes. Today, my question for the royals who is your king? Who is your source of preservation and protection? Who do you proclaim as your protector? For the shout of the king is in your midst. Amen. For they have proclaimed the king as their Lord. Amen. Before the key of the blood comes, you have an opportunity to proclaim king. Amen. To ensure that the shout of the king Jesus. is in your midst. Amen. Amen. I was so pretty out in San Lucas and Para. Yanko, you know, away and tum and now pay. There is no misfortune against Jacob. I said, Money be at the Yakob, the Biana, no trouble against Israel. Now, some Biana, my way, just because they recognize who the king is. Amen. As I said, Israel, who pay? Why anyone who in it? Lift up your hands wherever. Hey, I want some baby, I will be a red. Oh, Lord, my God, my God. When I'm in awesome wonder, consider, consider, consider all the works thy hands have made. The shout of the king is in your midst. Come on, let me hear your voice. I see the stars. Oh, Jesus. I hear the Some people will lift up their hands and say, Oh Lord, Lord my, my God. God, when I'm in awesome wonder, oh, what are you doing? You are praying a prayer. You are invoking Numbers chapter 23, verse 21. There shall be no misfortune, no misfortune, no calamity, no disaster. Hey, Kabe Amasua, I see. I hear the rolling thunder. There shall be no trouble against the royals. The black will speak for us. The other will speak for us. That shakes my soul. That shakes my soul.
will sink of the greatness. We will sink of his greatness. We will sink of his honor. May he carry a bag full of testimonies and miracles. And, receive it. and we shall continually to sing the greatness of God. Amen. How great thou art. How great. How great, how great thou art, how great 
go to three people and go and encourage them. Tell them their blood is still speaking. Oh, go, go and lift up somebody's spirit and tell them their blood is still speaking. Jesus is still king. He is still on the throne. Oh, go. He is still Lord. Say what you have Say what you have Say yes to that one. Please be seated wherever you are. You are welcome to the extra oil service on the 23rd of April in the oil dome, the headquarters of Royal House Chapel International. Amen. Our father and leader is the Apostle General Sam Crunchy Ankara. Yeah, Papa. Any Eja Sam Crunchy Ankara Nankasa. And today he's away on apostolic missions in the United States of America. And then we need and tell one demo on your own. Well, too far. I could do America memoir. Oh, yeah, but we have a very, very capable replacement in the oh. house. Amen. Ah, oh. one more with the one more with so the one people are defeated already. One thing. The mother of the house is here. Hey. Jesus, Mama Shilo. Today we shall be hearing the voice of the mother. Amen. The premier lady should be blessing us this morning. Man. And is we are going to have a wonderful service today. We have a very packed, packed, packed service for you. We have two choirs. We have uh, communion and impartation, and uh, we have a, a series of announcements and Thanksgiving services. If you are watching us online, you are welcome to Royal House. Uh, thank you for joining us on Facebook, on YouTube, and Powerline TV. You are listening to us on radio at Doom FM uh, in Accra, Empire FM in Takrade, Della Radio in Ho. God bless you. This is Royal House Chapel. Don't change that dial because a word is coming to you yeah. that will change your life forever. Amen. One more with them, and I want to hear you kind also. Utiye ye wa ba fudu fudu ye ina so ba fu fudu ye ina raso afi so ba power line television ye wahonom utiye nka wa dum e wa kraha se oko tapa ni nimpate mo abeti nka na afi so uba hompo a dela ubeti nka e wahonom ena no pay e timo fudu no efan tu bebiara e radia sam eba wachai e bema wa yresim na mau tu mi enso e wa brabo mu power line voices will be blessing us right now after which no power line voices. All right, Powerline Voices will be coming after the service. Now we will hear a story from one of the ministers of the house, Minister Isaac Fabio Wilson, after which Prince Chavez will mount the stage. Then the next voice we hear is the Premier Lady of Royal House Chapel. Don't go anywhere. Don't change yeah. your station. Don't be in a hurry to leave because yes. today the blood is about to speak for you. Amen. God bless you and enjoy your service. Oh, but we say here, right? yeah, Let's yeah. do it better. Let's do it better for the Lord. What a service. This morning, I've been humbled by the sheer presence and the anointing that we have experienced in our worship. Shall we give it together for the praise and worship team? On behalf of the Apostle General, the Most Reverend Sam Kranchiankra, and the Premier Lady from which we will be hearing a powerful message very soon, I want to welcome everybody to this morning's service, which is dubbed the Extra Oil Service. Amen. Our online viewers, thank you for being with us. If today is the first time you are joining us, all we want to say is, Relax, give us some few hours of your time. 
and God is going to transform your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Royal House, we say we touch our generation with the power of God. And how do we touch our generation with the power of God? Through prayer, through preaching, and through the manifestation of the power of God that is evidence in the presence that we have seen here this morning. Through the presence, the prophetic is also not left out. So today, as we are observing the 23rd, which our Father has already caught in on our 31st night service, the blood will be speaking for us. It doesn't matter what you are going through. It doesn't matter what is on your mind. The blood is going to go ahead and we are going to receive deliverance, breakthrough, and grace will speak for us. Amen. Offering time. Offering time. I know this week has been very challenging for some of us. Not even this week, but this first quarter of the year has been difficult. But today, I want you to take your offering with a different understanding. That despite whatever we are going through, despite the things that are on our mind, despite the questions that we have, we are bringing an offering to say, thank you, Lord, for preserving our lives. Yes, that marriage breakthrough may not have come yet. That contract that you're expecting, that job opportunity that you are waiting for, that scholarship, that child that is giving you difficulty and you are believing God to touch and to bring home. It hasn't been done yet. But once we have life, we know that God is not done with us yet. Amen. And so we are going to give an offering to say, thank you, Lord, for preserving our life and for giving us an opportunity. Because once we have life, we know you are not done with us yet. Shall we go into our bags? Shall we go into our purses? Let's take an offering to say thank you to God for what he's doing and for what he's about to do even through the blood and the covenant that we will be partaking of very soon. Let's go into our purses. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for such an awesome time before your presence. Father, we thank you that you have given us life and has given us the, another opportunity to touch our generation. We pray that may this sacrifice be acceptable unto you, that look down upon us with mercy, look down upon us with favor, look down upon us with your presence, that our lives will be transformed in the mighty name of Jesus. The ushers will be going around with the envelopes. Online worshippers, you are not left out. Currently running on your screens are the various platforms from which you can partake in this special thank you that we are giving to God for preserving our lives. It's my joy to be with you this morning I bring you the word of the Lord and I bring you a word that will open the door for you a word that will open your heavens and I'm bringing you a word from Ruth chapter 2 I'm looking at a character an Old Testament character a type of Christ hallelujah it's my joy to be with you this morning I bring you the word of the Lord and I bring you a word that will open the door for you, a word that will open your heavens. And I'm bringing you a word from Ruth chapter 2. I'm looking at a character, an Old Testament character, a type of Christ called Boaz. Boaz means in him is strength, in him is strength. And then um, uh, this poor woman, devastated woman called Naomi, who had left uh, uh, Judah and Benjamin to the land of Moab. Uh, over there, her husband dies, uh, two sons also died, and then um, uh, uh, she returns to Judah and Bethlehem with an in-law, a daughter-in-law called Ruth. And then Ruth bumps into Boaz by the divine orchestration of the hand of God, 
and Boaz becomes the husband of Ruth, bringing Ruth into the genealogy of Jesus Christ according to the book of Matthew chapter number one. Hey, I came here to let you know that it doesn't matter what the devil does and he's doing and whatever, the counsel of the Lord shall stand. The counsel of the Lord shall stand. So let's get the first lesson. The first lesson today is the divine hand of God, or what I call divine providence. Number one, Naomi and Ruth arrived in Judah just at the time of the harvest of the barley and wheat. Just at the time of the harvest. Number two, she arrives and she decides to go to any of the fields to go and glean leftovers of wheat that uh, falls normally on the ground. And then she happens to just go into the field of Boaz, divine orchestration. And then Boaz arrives, and then in verse 4, Boaz, Boaz arrives from uh, Bethlehem. He says, who is this woman? So here's what you should know about grace. You don't find grace. Grace finds you. And I came this morning to let you know that the grace of God is going to locate you. Grace of God is going to find you. There is nothing you should do without asking God for his grace. So what is grace? Grace is the manifestation of the favor of God a favor that comes from the highest authority. And so, except the Lord reveals from above, it cannot happen. I pray that may grace from above, may favor from above, may the divine hand and orchestrated hand of God appear in your daily dealings. I bless you in Jesus' mighty name. God bless you. I'll see you again. Come on. Give Jesus praise in this place. Come on, put your hands together for Jesus. If he's been good to you, come on, put your hands together and give him praise. Give him praise. Give him praise. Give him praise. Hallelujah. We give you glory, Lord. You are worthy to be praised. I have no other God but you. I have no other God but you. Oh, 
your voice, sing it. Be glorified.
Jordan, please be seated. I will need you again. Deacons, please be seated. Reverend Dr. Anas, I would want you to come and pray over our elements. One deacon, Deacon Abigail, please balance it. Can Dr. Nas have a microphone? Church. Stretch your hands towards the element of the body of Christ and the blood of Christ. The Bible teaches us in Exodus. That finally, when the children of Israel received emancipation, received approval from God Almighty to leave Egypt, the house of pain, the house of destruction, the house of death, and they were exiting Egypt finally. God caused them to pass through the Red Sea. And whilst they were living, the enemies of the Israelites, Pharaoh and his chariots, Pharaoh and his people, tried to follow them. But the same sea that parted into two for the children of Israel to pass through. The same sea swallowed the enemies of the, uh, the Israelites. This morning, we are saying that, Lord, by the token of the body of Christ and by the token of the blood of Jesus, Amen. the blood of redemption, Jesus. the blood of restoration, yes, the blood of salvation, yes, oh God, we pray for Royal House Chapel on the altar of our father, the Apostle Genoa. On the altar of our mother, oh God. We are saying that, Lord, let your blood go ahead of us, oh God. Yes. Go ahead of all royals, oh God. Yes. We and our children. Amen. We and our household. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. As we go through, Lord, our enemies who want us to die. Our enemies who want our children to die. Our enemies who want our spouses to die. Let this blood consume them yes. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Jehovah, we thank you. Yes, Lord. Jehovah, we give you praise. Yes, Lord. That the blood will speak for us. Amen. That the blood will go ahead of us. We receive it. In the month of April, we will end its war. Yes, Lord. We will enter into the month of May war. Yes, Lord. We will end. 31st of December 2023, well, yes, Lord. Lord, we depend on you. Yes. Amen. And we depend on the blood in Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. 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 My message this morning is the end of my captivity. I no pay as I'm about to know. Me am the atosu ese. Emra me pre ni me how ni mama ni wuni ginara ebe be riye ye. This year, the Royal Ladies theme is, it is my time to love. I feel way, it's not a Royal Ladies, and they call me competing, and say, me brasso, say, me so necessary. And it's the theme our father gave to us. When you tell me, I am here to announce to my enemies to announce to my enemies that I have started my laughter. I When the Lord brought back the captivity of Zion, we were like those who dream. Then our mouth was filled with laughter. And our tongue was singing. 
Then they said among the nations, The Lord has done great things for them. The Lord has done great things for us. And we are glad. I want to honor Apostle General wherever he is. We have already prayed for him. I know signs and wonders will follow his ministration in Atlanta. I see the Lord turn your sorrow into joy. I see your tears turn into laughter. Yes. I don't know who is crying this morning. Jesus. I don't know who is sad this morning. I don't know who has problems this morning. But I came to prophesy to you. Prophecy. You will live here with your laughter. I you will live, you live here with your laughter. You will live here with your laughter. You will live here with your celebration. You will live here with your dancing. I the it. Lord shall bring you out yes. of captivity. Your captivity will end this morning. Yes. I see you. You are coming out of hell. I'm out. I see you. You are coming out of sickness. I'm coming out. I see you. You are coming out of poverty. I'm coming out. I see you. You are coming out of death. Jesus. You will cry this morning. Yes. You will love this morning. I receive it. 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 Lord, I need you. Oh.
put the song on the screen. Captivity is the state or period of being held in prison, enslaved or confined. And Quasum and the church are saying, say, a young baby and I said, Baby, I want, and I said, 
probably a doom who now as a wish fiasco, now you shall do a sabbia, or to me, Pierre Cobaby, Ushafaco, a honum, and Enquasum. According to the Cambridge Dictionary, captivity is the situation in which a person is kept somewhere and is not allowed to leave. Cambridge for so etias etias yes. And kwasum eye se obi a wo she baabi a e kwan bia wo nya kwan ye bia se obekɔ baabi na waka fa ko honum e ho e na wo she the situation in which a person is kept somewhere and is not allowed to leave today you will leave amen amen, amen. And kwasum eye se obi ana se abra bo bia wo kɔ she baabia Unu kwan ani akwan ya bia so bepia ko bebia na waka fa ko na ye ma me se enade ye unka fa ko no ma wo bepie afi bebia wo che bia ra Psalm 126 is a song that looks at how the Jews had returned to Jerusalem following their exile in Babylon David nyom oha edio nu esia no e ya nyom bia Israel for to ye emra mo afi Babylon and Kwasumun, Omo Asai Abba Eradi Fie, Eye Israel. They have been in captivity for 70 years in Babylon. Omo Ashe Babylon, Omo Kwasumun, Ase Enfia Poropori Edio Son. Their freedom was first, firstly taken away from them. Na se Omo Yon Fa Wundi Edi Esa, Afa Wundi Enu, Yaji Efri Womun Sam. They had suffered so much pain. Then suddenly God comes around for them. God will come around for somebody this morning. I receive it. Cyrus, the new king of Persia, announced and allow the Jews to go back to Jerusalem where they belonged. Persia hine no ma hon kwa yse. Sambre yi diye, bebi e kodou diye, ye ma Israel fon hon kwa yi, no mon sain embrea o mukrom, e ye Israel memu. They were allowed to go home after 70 years of bondage, after 70 years of imprisonment, after 70 years of being closed, after 70 years of not being allowed to leave. And fear do someone a more or how I'm a crew or prayer as a mutafaco as a beer beer a year baby or mutimico baby. I know in fear do so to know your mom quite someone sign and coffee when they heard the news that they were going, they were shocked. Never a munya a summon and I saw what is that and fear do so as you know a moose and coffee no a young one and cassa. But this is the one that surprised me. When Cyrus announced their freedom, he didn't only announce their freedom, but he declared that anybody living around the Jews must give to them when they are going. The king himself, an unbelieving king himself, announced that when the Jews are going, they shouldn't go empty. They should go with silver. They should go with gold. Amen. They should go with diamonds. We receive it. They should go with livestock. We receive they it. They should go with precious things. We receive it. I am here to announce to my sons and my daughters Jesus. that when you are coming out of captivity, How about you won't come empty. Yes. yes. You won't come empty. Yes. yes. You won't come empty. Yes. Everything you have lost. Jesus. Within 70 years. Uh, God will give to you. I receive out it. Out of captivity. Yes. Out of Babylon. Yes. You will go as a billionaire. I receive it. You will go as a millionaire. I receive it. You will go with wealth. Yes. Lord. You will go with jewels. I receive it. You will go with money. I receive it. You will go with diamonds. I receive it. You are living. You are living. Yes, Lord. You are living. I am living. You are living prison. I, yes. You are living prison. Jesus. You are living prison. Yes, today Lord. With money full in your body. I receive it. You are living. 
with houses. I receive. You are living with cars. I receive. Everything they took away Jesus. from you. I am giving it back to you. I receive it. Oh, me. What do you do when you are waiting? What do you do when you are in captivity and you are waiting to come out of prison? What do you do? Other four, I'm not saying Kwasumu. Other four, I'm not your man Kosu Yemao. Other four, I'm not how I had this one as soon. They now be here and so I think Kwasumu every month. I want to leave you with four words this morning. And obey. And some person, some four best and nine, and a mini tau, and obey. Four words. And some four nine. The past, the process, your prayers, and your praise. The past, the process, your prayers, and your praise. Emrejum. Emra wuna mui on paibo anywa ye ye the past Emra jum you need to always look at what God did for you in the past. Tebiara da da fui kai 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 ni eradia yama u efie bi ajum kai ni eradia yama u mbi ajum kai ni eradia yama u look at how God. Helped you in the past. Shekwe rade faso ebu awo. Shekwe rade faso e ya doye e de mawo kai sambre no. Look at what he has already done for you. Na she ni rade ya mane chamu dada e de mawo. When you look at Psalm 126, verses one and two, our foundation text, it is actually talking. About the past. We shall be in your Mohania, your Nunciana, your kind, and some of the kind of you know. Or can Israel form be a chum or more problem? It's talking about how God helped them in the past. When you're ready for social, what Moso and fear be a chum, what God has done for them in the past. Yeah, Randy, I am only a chum. The same God who did it for you in the Past will do it for you again. Yes, man. On your Macron, I was son of on your Macron, or Bob Hope, I know on your Macron, I know Nancy, I know Sanya Macron, but say I ye be up at your mouth. What you do not know is that he's the same yesterday, he's the same today, and he's the same forevermore, he's the same tomorrow, my darling. What he did for you in the past, Jesus. he will do it for you again. Amen. Oh, the football with some year, right? Yeah, yeah. Many who are, sir, 
On a mis sa cro, on a mis sa cra de biarada. En rue, si on vient de mon yamino, ça y a mes cronates, 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 ça y The fact that you are crying today, the fact that you are in pain today, the fact that you are in tears today, doesn't mean that yesterday he didn't do anything for you. Come on. Sene esu a wusu, sene wu che jadjoi, sene o breda wusi, eno anfa wuse e radi ye bi ma o debi alada, e radi a ye dudu ona ma o, o ti a si empo, che se radi a ye bi. Sometimes, We brood so much in our pain that we forget to look at our past. We forget to concentrate about our past. We forget to remember the God who was with us yesterday. The God who healed you when you were sick is about to do it again. Amen. Oh, you're going to pass away. You're going to pass away. Pass away. Maybe you're going to say that 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 the God that gave you the marriage will keep the marriage. Amen. The God that gave you the children Jesus. will keep the children. Amen. The God that gave you the job will protect you. Amen. David says in Psalm 30, I will extol you, O Lord, for you have lifted me up and have not let my foes Rejoice over me. The Lord Oh Lord, you have lifted me up past tense. You brought me up from the grave past tense. You restored my life as I was going down to the grave. Past tense. My darling, he is also the God of the past tense. Yes. If he did it for you yesterday, Jesus. he will do it for you today. I receive it. David remembers how God successfully delivered him from the past. He delivered him from his troubles. David David knew that when difficult times come, when problems come, he must remember that the God that delivered him before is the same God who can deliver him again. Amen. He did it before. Jesus. And he will do it again. Amen. And in person, and right now, what you have done is so, and right now, what you have done is so, and right now, what you have done is so, and right now, what you have done is so, and right now, what you have done is so, and right now, what you have done is so, and right now, what you have done is so, and right now, about two years ago, I was in UK. I had gone to visit late Mrs. Collison, who is currently worshiping with us from heaven. 
Wakoya rade dia no ente ya no ono no ewo. She had lost her mother, and I decided to go and mourn with her. Nani mamia frimu enti yoko esa wakoma ni yako wakoshe nungkunai. When I was coming on the way, I was feeling very, very funny. I mean, extremely funny. No fi ni chao sana ba no ono ahu ni ni pe biemo ahu ni mbi bi eko swa enya di bi a edu ni bua na se aye eman. That day I was fasting, and I hadn't broken my fast, so I thought it was because of the fast. It was because of the weakness of the fast. Nesabria emreya no kase no wa akwanti ni muti aye nesabia o akwanti ni na akwanti no ema ane amani ema aye ni ema wani ni pe biemo it's not just akwanti no ene aye ni eko suno. All of a sudden I couldn't breathe. Emu ano na fi ne humi aye si, and I could feel that my breath. Was was going? My breath was leaving me. And when Hun said, "Hey, baby, I don't know," now Hun me, "Hey, yeah, etcha." Then I remembered I needed to check my pressure. And okay, sir, I was also saying, "Ni mo ja esi ejima e wodi pedi emu." When I checked my pressure, it was about one eighty six ninety five at the time. Oshia, you know, na ni awapu wa sunu chese na akone ni iye angaza. Then I took medication. Tio Fedro. I realized that the medication wasn't working. And you know, said, "Don't know why you're crying there. Anya, anya, he cry, eh, mano." After about fifteen, twenty minutes, I checked my pressure again, and this time it had gone to about over two hundred, one or something. Yes, sir. My dear, you know, you know, so she said, "I'm not coming to see Bobby. I'm not free. I didn't pay the cost for him. You know, you know." For some reason, I didn't fret. I wasn't afraid. I was relaxed. Because I had gone through another experience about two years prior to that in America. Where I found myself for the first time in an ambulance. And my pressure had gone so high. And the paramedics in the ambulance kept testing my pressure, trying my pulse, trying to see whether I could see. I mean, it was terrible. I did so, so, so many tests. At the time, they thought I was even getting a stroke. But you see, that God that delivered me in America. Jesus. When I became sick again in UK, I wasn't afraid mm. because I knew that that same God same that God. delivered me in America same God. will do it again in UK. Yes. If it happens again in Ghana, Jesus, it will deliver me. Same God. If it happens again in Cape Coast. He will deliver Same me. God. If it happens again in the north, it will, will deliver Same me. Same God. It doesn't matter where I go. Jesus. The God of the past hey. will do it one more time. Yes. Oh, but we see me here, Radia. I see we land in Nakuma. Do I say name Radia? You be a man, oh, oh. America, America. The name we are, the Ankasa. Ah, no, we will say. Ni eba the name we are now so. Sonya mikro no ayi ni fi America de anu a say to no you go say your South Africa say your Ghana memo sonya mikro na on sesa na onwu na na wiye mba no no yenya me say anya mikro na ebeji no afi ba bibiara na say bia bia no wo mu no obeye saa ama no abere biara amen lady de kana hastings the whole night The Lord was speaking to me about you. And he says I should tell you the God that was with you in the past. The God that was with you in UK. The God that was with you at British Airways. That same God will be with you. Amen. If he did it for you yesterday, Jesus. he will do it again today. Amen. He will do a better when God is moving with you Jesus. into your future. 
He does better in the future. Amen. More than he did it yesterday. Yes, Lord. Because he is greater than yesterday. Amen. My darling, he will do it better. Say it the Lord. Amen. The Lord says, I should tell you, he will wipe your tears. Amen. And shall not be long. Amen. What he did for you in the past, he will do it more than today. Amen. Are you in Jesus? Are you in Jesus? Sometimes you want to give up and you want to ask yourself, is that all to life? Is that what God has for me? Is that what my end will be like? My darling, it's only a process in your life. Yes. Tell somebody it is only a process yes. in your it life. It is only a process in your life. You ask yourself, will I ever be happy again? You ask yourself, would I ever laugh? 
I am here to let you know Jesus. you are coming out of captivity. Yes. yes. You will laugh again. I receive it. You will it. laugh again. I receive it. You will laugh again. I receive it. You will dance again. Yes, Lord. You will be happy one more time. Yes. You ask yourself, why does God so seem so far away? Why doesn't God ever answer me? Week of the altar. Why do some people give testimonies and I don't get to give testimonies? Week of the altar, royal ladies camp, WMG camp, men's camp, people are holding the microphone and they are giving testimonies. And you ask yourself, when would it be my turn? I am here to let you know Jesus. your turn is coming. I yes. receive it. You would also give a testimony. Yes. yes. You would also have a breakthrough. Yes. You will also laugh. Amen. Ah. But with some year right here, yeah. you are asking yourself, does Mama Rita know I don't have a job? Does she know I am not married? Does she know? I've been married for so long without a child. Does she know that I am begging for food? Does she know that I wear the same clothes every day? I might not know, but I know a man up there yeah. who sees all things yes. and in his own time will make all things beautiful. beautiful. Amen. What you are going through is a process. Process. Ni awu na mu ya ya mreti ya mu. Ni awu na mu ya no sube bebe tumwa kwa. Eya no bisa wu sana mama rito nim. Se bi nya wari ya. Mama rito nim sama wari fye bi mi nyapa. O nim se bi nya juma ya. O nim ya o nim wo se so ya nipa ti se wa. Ne mo ya ni mo biya. O ya ya nyan kupwa. O nim ni awu na mu ya na. O se min kanchan no pese. Ni awu na mu ya. Who tells you you will be in debt forever? Weeping may endure in the night, but joy cometh in the morning. Yes. Your joy is coming. I receive it. Your joy is coming. I receive it. I receive it. I receive it. I see your night passing. Jesus. I see your night passing. Yes, Lord. I see your weeping passing. Jesus. I see your weeping as yes. And joy is coming. I receive it. I receive it. Solomon says in Ecclesiastes 3 to everything not to some things to everything there is a season a time for every purpose under heaven a time to weep and a time to laugh a time to mourn and a time to dance your laughter is coming I receive it your dancing is coming I receive it your laughter is coming I receive your dancing is coming I receive it you must always remember that difficult times don't last forever. Yes. It is only a season in your life. Jesus. It is only a period in your life. Amen. It is only a process. That one shall also pass. That is why when you are weeping and you are crying, in your night situation, 
You should be careful what you do. Come on. My darling, hey. don't sell your body for mobile phone. Sell your body for papaya oh. or KFC. Oh. Don't sell your body because of shoes, yeah. my darling. When I have to come to church, <laughs> I wear my dress, I take one shoe in the left, half shoe in the left, half shoe on the right. I go to Apostle General. Um, my darling, you will look back. Jesus. Yeah. Don't go selling drugs because of what you will get today. God has something in store for you tomorrow. I receive it. But we say here, right here, here. Actually, the sense is maybe can't tell us. I did a way you were. I said here, no beer. I want a beer. You want beer? You just say. You want a sumbre? You want beer? You want a soda? You want beer? You want a beer? A beer? A beer? A beer? Who tell you what now? And koto uni pedia, e ma mobile phone. Ohu chile wona. And koto uni pedia, e fanti KFC. Ohu chile wona. And keke ka in Zambia, e be sorry etia we urade. Ohu chile wona. And koye pre people ni bi me catch na ose. Wonso wumbre e be ba. Embre ba e wo homa o. Ni a ufemu i. And kosi de bi arada. E tu be ja e wo baby na urade e di e di abrewo. Amen. When you go looking for a job, and whoever must give you the job wants to sleep with you, tell the person, whether you give me a job or not, you will see me tomorrow, and you will be ashamed. Amen. My darling, it's only a process in your life. You've heard my story so many times. And had, you've heard my testimony so many times. Where I married during our honeymoon, my darling, we didn't even have where to live, where to stay after the honeymoon. We didn't know where we we're going to stay. We didn't have. When we came back, that place, cry was it called? Where the marble is, where we stayed, eh? The Akuma Junction. There's a big house there with so many people. About 30 people will use one bathroom and toilet. You have to wake up at 3 a.m. and queue with your buckets. What to eat was a problem. That's where my mother got for her a small room. Use my cover cloth. as a curtain unfortunately for me got pregnant I'm sure within the honeymoon time what to eat was a problem moved from that small kitchenette room to a hall and chamber we had no right to wake up in the morning and sink. The landlord will ask us, have you ever bought cement block before? Went to the labor ward. 
people go to the labor world with napkins and new dresses and um, cushions and my mother-in-law was baking bread use the um, how do you call it Ashkenshan Kotoku I don't know how to say it in English the cloth of the flour that's what she used cut them sew the ends wash them and that is what I used as my core sheet for Nanakus it was time to come out of hospital how was I going to come out who was going to pay for me it was chief deacon and her husband who paid for me to come out of hospital I use her children's baby coat use her children's old clothing use her children's napkins went to look for trouble within two years I had Reverend Papa if you were looking for the definition of poverty you needed to look at me my husband and my children we had to move from the hall and chamber back to Gaza in my parents home my old bedroom was where I was staying myself my husband Reverend Naka Reverend Papa and Deacon Sister Asabia we were all in that small room my darling what I didn't know at the time was that it was only a process whatever you are going through now is a process in your life yes you will look back and you will ask yourself is this me Jesus. how did I come out of captivity Jesus. How did the Lord take me out of pain? How did God take me out of sorrow? How come that now I can laugh? How come that now I can dance? How come that now? Well, since I'm in you, we'll go to the song. Listen carefully. You have the chance to take communion only once today only once if you are going through a process in your life things are so tough what to eat is a problem you wake up in the morning and you ask God when people are giving testimonies about their jobs Testimonies about their marriages. Testimonies about their babies. And you ask yourself, God, when? If you are going through a process in your life, and life is so difficult, please come for communion. When you come, you might not come again for the others. So if you are going through a difficult time in your life, please come for one communion. Go ahead. When you come for it, you can open it. Pray and ask God to take you out of the process. It's me, Bamini. Now I am a when you are coming, oh. come with your son.
and Brometia see you soon. me, Mighty men, please come and direct them. No, I am Everybody take just one. Struggling. What about how you are allowed to come only once? A habit that was in us all back. You are not coming, you are not going through too much struggle. Sit down, there will be other times to take communion. So, maybe now, so how did you put that? What's up, brother? So, and what about Raja? You have a cup. And soon, yeah. for you take one listen to instructions this morning yes sir mo bi biara e fa ba ku ba ku pe o fa bi edu a e wa o o fa bi edu a enya bi bi pe bi e ba o ti bi e fa ba ku pe ba ku take one o bi e yi ba ku pe o ko so o se be bi one ba ku if you've taken two bring one back the two will not work my darling the lord will protect you you will go through the process. You will win every battle. You will be one with you. What you be now? What you be now?
people do not know whether they should come or not. Please don't be in a hurry. And you are supposed to come only once. When you come the first time, you can't come again. Number three. Your prayers. Psalm 126 verse 5. Psalm 126 verse 5 Those who sow in tears shall reap in joy Those who sow in tears shall reap in joy Those who sow in tears shall reap in joy Whilst you are waiting, don't just be sitting down. Whilst you are going through the process, don't just be sitting down. So in tears. Your tears is your prayers. So tears of prayer. As you pray continually. As you go to the Lord continually in prayer. You will finally reap in joy. Amen. There was a persistent widow that went to a judge, a judge who was not born again, a judge who was not a Christian, a judge that didn't fear the Lord, went to her continually day and night. And the judge refused her for a while. But the widow tormented and worried the judge. The judge had no option than to listen to this woman. The judge had no option than to listen to this woman. This is Jesus. Yes, he, okay. Hear what the judge just said. And shall God not avenge his own elect who cry out day and night to him? And then Radia Yasutie, Emma Neba, I am so friend of Da, 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 Biare. Will God not avenge? His own, as you are who ready. cry out day and night to him, though he bears long with them. As you are ready and come, man, pay. As you are ready and come, in your house, and come, man, oh, and no, Koswa, Koswa, I didn't have some here, and to the Nimui. My darling, out of way, as you pray day and night, so Koswa, Napania, Yania, and Ajoba, and Paye. As you saw in tears, now what is your mu? Odi a radiant paye ekoi. Our Father in heaven, yet our sorrow, the man upstairs, near to sorrow, 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 sorrow no. The man up there, baby, your what sorrow hoi? The man who doesn't sleep nor slumber. Jesus, near under no one can compare with a brave woman no. The man, the man. My darling, I have seen him. Amen. I have tasted him. Amen. And I have come to tell you yes. the man up there is good. Yes. Amen. The man up there answers.
Jesus' prayers. Yeah. Sometimes it looks like he's keeping long. Jesus. Sometimes it feels like he won't do it. Debbie. But I have come to tell somebody. Yeah. And Jan Jebia will not fail. Yes. It doesn't matter how long it takes. It is just a day. Amen. He will do it. Yes. He will do it. Yes. He will do it. Yes. On yes, I be my was three. Me ma sona she na me huna ampara se ampara ampara bibi biara yira wa nedi mu de biara da anja je bia wa na fi se se wiya bo adie to me sa sa adie sa adie to me ti anje na won so wemre na du e ye mre tie bi eno so bebe be chem akọ essence ono ne mre de en ka je de biara da what you do not know that any tie and every tear of yours, your cry never goes wait. Amen. He collects it in a bottle. Oh, Jesus. And he keeps track. He keeps track. He keeps track. He keeps track over your pain. He keeps track yes. over your sorrow. He keeps track over your request. One day, like the king who couldn't sleep, Jesus. will go through the books and ask what has been done to Mordecai my darling your bottle is being lifted up yes. Yes. your book is being opened yes. it is time to laugh oh, it seven. is time to be set free it is time to come out I of captivity tell them oh my darling don't be tired of sowing tears. Ah. Don't be tired of praying. Yes. He says, morning and evening. Yeah. If I were you, I won't talk with Friday miracle service. Come on. Last Friday was so powerful. Amen. Was so powerful. Amen. I prayed like I was crazy. Jesus. I prayed like I was mad. I don't know. My darling, be part of the monthly fasting and prayer on Thursday was it Thursday on Thursday yes there was a program here on Friday morning so on Thursday I came around to check if everything was okay in the oil dome I went through a hint here when I was going I could see and hear Reverend Adam leading pillars so powerful Amen. my darling if i were you during my process time during my waiting time anywhere there's prayer on this compound Jesus. whether you are part of pillars or not whether you are part of armor bearers or not whether you are a male born or not whether you were a woman deborah tree tuesday friday miracle service my darling don't joke yes our father has already warned us about year 2023 my darling who did tea grow i don't know how to say this in english our father has already warned us it's not like we don't see it's not like we didn't hear it's not like he has already warned us Jesus. my darling Year 2023 is a year for casualties. If you joke, if I were you, Friday after Friday, I am sitting on the altar. Amen. Oh, but we somewhere. We need to hear your prayer, but no. Engusa kwa 
we wura do nyankopon no ebe ye ho adwuma empa ebo no ya no pa empa ebo no ya nyumre no o sin ka uni oni wu a enka fie da pa ebo fe ni agro say ya pile so say ya mo bere so be bia o beti empa ebo bia wo de ho be gurem e fie da nyumre uni ho agro ye beba no na wo ti ota no so a wo bo pa ye onu a enfa empa ebo ni agro emre ye wo mi e ye mre boni ye papa se ya se dada na so wi afia ma men ka wo se ye wo duonu mi asa e wo fie duonu mi asa mu enfa pa e bo ni agro enfa pa e bo ni agro awurade pe ene betumi aye ama wo today you are in the oil dome today you are in the oil dome ene de uti oil dome you are the altar of your father wo ete wo fo o papa afore mu ka so you are going to rise or sit or kneel whatever you do you are going to take an opportunity and so tears of prayer yeah. you are going to lift up your voice yes and you are going to pray whilst we are doing that listen if you have prayed any prayer and the prayer has delayed you have asked god for anything and it has delayed you are expecting something from god and you haven't received an answer your enemies are chasing you you can feel death threatening you you can feel death knocking at your door you will come for one communion are you listening to me Yes. We are going to pray. Whilst we are praying, you have placed a request before God. And you want to see God. You want to hear God. You want to experience God. You are expecting him to do that miracle for you. You are going to rise up with your voice lifted up. Open your mouth Jesus. and say my father, my father. My father, my father. Say my father my father my father my fighter my father my fighter my father my fighter fight for me 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 speak for me speak for me this one prayer just one prayer that i have placed before that i placed before you answer me oh god 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 open your mouth and pray Lift up your voice. Ileme ko shanta ka basuli bri ante. The church of God is in prayer. The Bible said the other day, if my people that are called, that are called by my name, will humble themselves and they will pray, the Bible said, I shall hear them. Child of God, clap your hands. Lift your voice. Lift your voice. Lift your voice. Don't get tired. We are declaring. Oh God, let the blood spread. Let the blood, even the blood of Jesus, the Bible said, when I see the blood, I'll pass over. We are declaring by the voice of the blood, by the voice of prayer, by the voice of intercession. Ila Mataka, Basuna Planta, the church is in prayer. The church is in warfare in the name of Jesus. I have said it, please. You are coming only once. Oh baba akope. Oh concern me be your mistrabo. If you came during the process, don't come again. Say emra ya koso ni adi kai no. Oh ba dia If you come take only one. Oh ba so afa ba akope. If you take two, it won't work for you. O fa bia do dia. E dia bi bi enye biara e ma. When we are done. When we are done and some is left. Ye wie na se bia ka. I give you the opportunity. Yeah, my Mister Obama, when you are standing so be pure. Open your mouth. Open your mouth in prayer. In the battle, turn the matter. But surely, be antaka. Be serious in prayer. Let the fire your body. Let the fire your soul. Let the fire your spirit. The Bible said, "For the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? For the Lord is the strength of my life. Whom shall I be afraid? If my enemies, if in my foes." The Bible said, when they come up against me, they will stumble, they will fall, they will stumble, they will fall. Let the blast, let the blast, let the blast, 
of Jesus. Let the blood speak. Open your mouth. Lift your voice and get in prayer. Basuna bata, barataka, ikadusa, basuna ba. I saw fire, I saw fire, I saw fire, I saw fire in the building, I saw power in the building. Lift your voice, Bible said, for the weapons of our warfare, they are not cannot. The weapon of the blood, the weapon of the cross, the weapon of the blood. Lift your voice, pray like a warrior, pray like a menace. Ilabataka, Basubranta, pray. Your voice in prayer. One thing I have desire, the Lord, my request will be known unto you uh, and will be granted unto you. Uh, testimony, no call by this blood. Lord, come and change my life. Uh, turn this around for my good. Uh, in the name of Jesus, we pray may endure for a night. Uh, but joy coming in the morning. Uh, your joy is here. Your laughter is here. Your celebration is here. Your hour of visitation is here. Lift up your voice. Confirming her. Uh, your congratulation moment has come. Uh, it's time to marry. It's time to deliver. It's time to get pregnant. It's time to be employed again. Lift up your voice. This morning, uh, the blood is in your hands. Uh, life and power lies in your tongue. Uh, this morning, declare a thing uh, and it shall be established. Uh, this morning, oh God, we provoke the altar. Oh, uh, Father, we are saying, Heavenly Father, speak for us. Uh, may the blood speak. Uh, let the weeping cease. Uh, let the struggle cease. Uh, let, oh God, uh, the truth uh, of the Lord uh, come with evidence. Uh, Say, protect us, oh Lord. Uh, protect us, oh Lord. Protect Protect us, oh Lord. Protect us, oh Lord. Protect us. Protect us. From the number, from 23. The number 23. Protect us. 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 From the number. From the number. 23. 23. Today. Today. 23. 23. 23. 23. 23. 23. Fire. In the year. In the year. 20. 20. 23. 23. Protect, protect us. Protect us. He was saying, protect us by the blood. Through the blood, by fire, by thunder, any danger in the number 23, minus us and our family, exempt us, so called, spare our lives, so called, in the name of Jesus. The blood is speaking, the blood is speaking, the blood is speaking better day than the blood of Abel is speaking for you this morning. 23, 23. Shapedia to lift up your voice. We invoke the blood, we speak the blood for covering over the saints. To this morning, we invoke the power of the blood for covering and for preservation. We come against the righteous of the enemy, we come against the enchantment of the wicked, against the righteous, any ambushment of the enemy, any punishment against the righteous. This morning, by the voice of the blood, by the mercies in the blood.
when the one who was supposed to curse us was actually going on the mission to curse us now his own donkey begins to talk Jesus. and whisper Jesus. it was to him like madness Jesus. my darling I prophesy yes. those who want us to be ashamed Jesus. don't be mad Right. Don't be mad. We receive Don't it. Don't be mad. We receive it. They will walk naked. Yes. Those who want us to die. Jesus. Those who want us to fail. Jesus. On the altar of my father. Yes. On the altar of my father. Yes. On the altar of my father. Yes. I declare. Yes. That there will be a change. In the name of they Jesus. They will go mad. Yes. They will go mad. Yes. They will go mad. Yes. microphone in my hand. Jesus. Today, I make a wall of fire around you. Jesus. I make a wall of fire. Yes. I make a wall of fire. Yes. I send the fire yes. into your home. Yes. Into your home. Yes, Lord. Into your home. Into your home. Bacunias. Today, Bacunias. today, we trample over Bacunias. death. Bacunias. We trample over yes. death. We trample over yes. death. We trample 
trample over yes. death. We trample over death. Yes. We trample over death. Yes. There's a war going on, My darling, I will do my portion. Apostle General will do his portion. If you refuse to do what you are supposed to do, things have been made for you. Friday miracle service. It's day led made for you. My darling, don't leave yourself out. Day after your blood, day after the blood of your children, until 23rd is over, until the year 23 is over. Don't relax, don't sleep. Adafui, a person general, I am here. Yeah, mommy, I am here. I can't wait to see you by your so if you're if you're and you will free my so my last and I am done your praise why yeah Psalm 126 verse 6 Your praise Your seed Your seed Your sacrifice Is always your worship And is always your praise to God Psalm 126 verse 6 He who continually New King James He who continually goes forth Weeping Bearing seed for sowing Bearing seed for sowing Shall doubtless Come again with rejoicing, Amen. bringing his sheaves with him. Amen. No koswa, no koso, edi nisio. Na okuta aba ewe nisem. A okwe kwe dianon. Enke chile man ke biara dana. En chenso. En na aye ye efri nemo aba. Na ni obu ingina. Nensa ebe soni ingina remu. It's not nice in the New King James. N-I-R-V. New International Reader's Version. Listen, I don't know if we have it. New International Reader's Version. Those who go out weeping as they carry seeds to plant will come back Sinking with joy, they will bring the new crop back with them. Omo epie eni nisio na ekute di aba e omo semu a omo koko di ano ebe sign wangi eti aba e di aye ye nyom esan se nyomu di ye na obu breno omo esa beka ni na ebu ni ni nara. Andrew, mum. And everybody in this church that gives, listen to your mother. Don't allow anybody to tell you that giving is wrong. At least I see it here. Other four, a most David in your catray, I would David in your head, your nuncia, and it's a musian. Don't let any man of God anywhere tell you your first fruit is wrong. My darling, it's in the Bible. Your tithe is wrong. It is when their ministry is coming to an end, when they see they are failing, that they start preaching this kind of prayers. Jesus. As for us, Jesus, what was taught to us Come on. at the time we became born again can never be changed. Come on. Oh, but we some here right there, yeah. And more be now, 
don't still like it in the NIRV. There's another version we don't have. TPT. The Passion Translation. Psalm 126, verse 6. And royal ladies, get ready for come 2023. Jesus. They may weep as they go out carrying their seed to sow. My darling, there is nobody including Apostle General who gives and gives well and doesn't cry. My darling, some giving, after you have finished giving, you go home and the devil is whispering to you, are you a fool? Why did you have to give the sacrifice? Are you the only one in the auditorium? Don't you know what to do with your money? You are giving your money to a man. Who ever told you you are giving your money to a man? I gave some money that made me cry, mama. But after I gave that money, I have never regretted. Amen. Tell them and I read the scripture. Onia ema obi en nada wo. Se u yi bi amano enya di a ya hunkuno. Se u zika pa wo di eku akomano. No bi baka chos efa koma sa abe mano. Muni se enya pe me bi ena odi eku akomano. Ne mumu di eku akomo onya kupombi. Ne zika u yi ana se yi bi a u yi a. Eka u ankasa no. Ono so e yebi. Ne mum enu e chino. Ni e radi yema no no. E puri na chie eni nti asiaso. Minister Kwabna. The Lord spoke to me about you. The Lord says, your period of crying and weeping is over. Amen. Sometimes we have never spoken, but sometimes you ask yourself, everything I'm doing, is it really working? my sacrifices my job as the head of protocol my altar the sacrifices I give is it really working what is what is happening to me Minister Kwabna, the Lord says I should tell you if God sent me to preach this message Jesus he says, I should tell you, your weeping period has ceased. Amen. Your time for crying has expired. Amen. You are going to laugh. Let me close so that Reverend Papa can give me the microphone again when his father travels. Psalm 126 verse 6 The Passion Translation They may weep As they go out Carrying their seed to sow But they will return With joyful laughter We receive it And shouting with gladness Jesus as they bring back I wish we had it there as they bring back as they bring back arm loads wow. of blessings amen and the harvests amen. overflowing amen I'm Parase. Nisumu and Omukuta, where you are about Muka Kodia, or Brenya Manuno, how any Nisun or Muka Kodia Nemum, so who saw much if you be able to be no air bar, Wamodi or poor, any Esra, any and Nepa, 
Any ato yani adie nyina omwanya afri omo afuo mu no eno eno omo de bepa they will return joyful laughter with joyful laughter shouting with gladness and they bring arm loads of blessing and the harvest overflowing if you have given any form of sacrifice I'm talking to those who haven't come. That is why you shouldn't have rushed. If you have given any form of sacrifice, and you haven't seen the results, or you saw the results, but the results were small, I want you to come out and take your communion now. Quickly. So if you haven't come, I want you to come out now. If you haven't come at all. The Lord is my shepherd. Has everybody been here? Not want. Quickly. He making me to lie down. In green pastures, he led me besides the still.
There was a program here this week. Thursday, Friday, I was here. I leave home at 5 a.m. My darling, anybody who is ready for a sign, come for a thousand Ghana cities. Stand in front when I want to do it myself. Stand in front when you come. Please, nobody is forcing you to come. If you are hearing voices, don't come. If I am one of the false prophets, don't come. If I am taking money from you, please, I'm coming. Please, I'm coming. Please, I'm coming. If I'm taking money from you to go and do my hair, don't come. If I'm taking money to buy fuel into my car, don't come. God must do something for me this week. 500. 500. 500. Quickly, thousand, five hundred, five hundred. Five hundred. God must cause our ears to hear good news. God must do something for us. Hey! I can feel like our enemies think they have gotten us. I can feel like our enemies are laughing at us. God must speak. God must speak. God must speak. God must act. You have no idea the things I have heard this week. Eradicasa. Eradicasa. Eradicate woman. Eradicasa ma woman. If your tithe is ready, please come. Take communion from me today. If you are ready with your tithe, please come out. Take communion with me today. 200. Come. 200. Come. 200. Come. 200. Come. Your tithe is ready. Come. In the of Reverend Agri, please come and help me. Oh. Reverend Agri.
children. How dare them? Yeah, now you almost say you're nyamen or what da. They think our God is asleep. Reverend our grace at the other end. Please go ahead. This morning, with our seed in our hands, with the blood and body of Jesus. process has taken too long. Take us out of captivity. Take us out of prison. Take us out of trouble. Take us out of difficulties. Father, Onyame, Yabemu ye ebu. One Nigerian Jewi ata. On the altar of my father, I send the blood into every home. I send the blood into every home. Speak for us. Defend us. Make a way for us. Let them know we have God. I send for the blood. On every doorpost, every eye, every ears, every nose, every mouth, 
All our senses. I use the blood as a doorpost. When the evil one comes, when they see the blood, let us pass, let them pass over us in the name of Jesus. Open it. This week, our years we hear good news. Amen. Open it. Open it. Say, on the altar of my father. On the altar of my father. On the altar of my father. I lift up the body of Jesus. I lift up the body of Jesus. As I eat. As I eat. Let my body. Let my body. Be yours. Be yours. When they are looking for me. And my, children, and my children, let them not see me. Let them, not see me. Let them see you, Jehovah. Let them see you, Jehovah. Drink. Hey, eat the blood. Go to your seat. Drink some and apply. Those who have cars, leave a little when you enter into your car. Drop some into your car. The God of your father will go ahead of us. If you have 100 and you have 50, please come. If your money is ready, please put it in the offering bowls. You are worthy of my praise. If you have 100, you have 50. Please come. Take it and stand in front. If you have 150, 20, please come quickly. This is not our offering, please. This is a special sacrifice. Reverend Papa, where are you? Oh, hey, but did I invite you? Fifty, twenty, please come. Ten, please come. Yes, you are worthy of a praise. Fifty, twenty, ten, please come. I'll leave you for Reverend Papa. Have you been blessed today? Have you been blessed today? My darling, God will fight for us. Our God will fight for us. I cancel death. I cancel sickness. I cancel every terminal disease. In any home. I shall not want He made me Have you to lie down, down in repose May the body and he the blood me speak for you beside the still
Bless the name of the Lord. anybody out come and drop it and then take one come and take it and drop one and take one if you are being led to take one communion into your home or into your office you can do it if you are being led to take one into your home one into your office you can do it go ahead sacrifices to the altar if you haven't accessed the altar anything you have Come and engage the altar. It's the day of the blood. The 23rd of 23. He anointed. He anointed my head with oil. Come on. He anointed my head with oil. Some people have taken communion about 10. Because every time the communion is mentioned, you are coming forward. This is for those who are sick. You are going to bless somebody who is sick. Those who is not in church. Those who are those who were not in church. You came for the first anointing, second anointing, third anointing. This one you are taking three, four. How many demons are chasing you? If you still have your first one, the first anointing, it's available to you. Use it as you please. Apply it as you please. This is for those who are not in church. You are going to minister to somebody who is not in church. In the first century believers. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. Dickens, please be ready. And I shall dwell. Be ready. In the house of the Lord. Forever and ever. Forever. And Mighty man, please help us with the table. And I shall in the house of the Lord. Forever and ever. Forever and I shall dwell. If you need to. Take one for a sick relative at home. After service, just see the dickens in the corner. Please, let's go to the corner, to the corner, to the corner. Chief, please, not here, not here, go. Mighty men, tables. How many of you have been blessed today? Amen. Come on, put your hands together for Jesus. Those of you online, you were not left out. As usual, as usual. Any red drink, any piece of biscuit, any piece of cake, any piece of bread, you can participate in the anointing with us. The first one was the anointing to end struggle. The anointing to end struggle. Number two. The, or the process, right? They're anointed to end the process of struggle. Number two, a prayer you have prayed and you have not seen the manifestation. We are ending the delay of the manifestation of every prayer. Partake in the anointing. And then the last one, you are backing it up with a sacrifice. You are expecting a miracle this week. This week. 
you are expecting good news this week you are sowing into the anointing and you are partaking in the blood those of you at home if you need all three please partake in all three because yeah the communion you bought it yourself so it's available to you any red drink any biscuit any piece of cake any piece of bread you and your family the head of the household administer the tokens for the entire house and you will be blessed amen those in person um, if your sacrifice was not ready Mama Rita called the tithe so please come and um, drop your tithe first fruit pledge tithe first first fruit and pledge and your special sacrifice thousand cities 700 cities 500 cities 200 cities please engage the altar engage the altar if you need an envelope please wave your hand and an usher will serve you we are wrapping up the service in the next six minutes in the next six minutes worship team we have done the title already but in case you missed it you didn't hear it please this opportunity drop your sacrifice if you didn't partake in the blood you have a piece already if you don't you please go to the taking's corner and you will be duly served yes. you are worthy of a While we are doing that, we want to celebrate with the latest couples in town, Mr. and Mrs. Titus Glover Abankwa and Mr. and Mrs. Bwedi, who started a journey with Jesus Christ yesterday. Oh, come on, come on. Shall we acknowledge? We celebrate with you. Congratulations. The Apostle General would like to celebrate your wedding with you. So when he gets back, he will be releasing a father's blessing with your marriage certificate. You'll be informed by the resident pastor. So you make yourself available in church that day. We seal every declaration and every prophecy that was spoken on the altar. We pray and we declare that the oil that was poured over your head shall never run dry. You will celebrate 30 years. You will celebrate 50 years. Your house will be full of joy and laughter. Seed will come out of this marriage. In the name of Jesus, you are blessed and highly favored. Amen. If you have a sacrifice, you can place it at the altar. God bless you. There is another wedding coming up to finish the month of April. It's happening on Saturday, 29th of April, between God's Way, Ezra of the Foundation School and Amoberes Prayer Ministry, and Mary Owusu Efriye of Pillars of Praise and Amoberes Ministry. 1 p.m. at Ahimfie. Please come for it quickly, 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 quickly. We ask that the God of your father will go ahead of you and will settle every confusion. This will be one of the best days you have celebrated in your life because joy and celebration will be seen in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. God bless you. This Saturday is a very, very packed one for us in the headquarters of Royal House Chapel. As we are celebrating the wedding, there are about three child christenings or baby christenings happening simultaneously uh, so technicians instrumentalists uh, church workers security ushers please please we need you to help us it's a very busy day on saturday on the same day royal ladies are meeting at 3 p.m in the main auditorium then the national executive retreat of the men makers ministry will also be happening at 9 a.m same saturday 29th 9 a.m men makers national executive retreat people are coming from all the regions 9 a.m here at the headquarters then um on the 20 on the 7th 7th of may 7th of may that's in two weeks 7th of may next two weeks 
we have the King's Service um, Ministry. They are celebrating Career Day. Career Day. We've been doing this for a few years. It is not a very strange precedent. All children are dressing in the career that they wish to become. The career that they wish to become. So if your child wants to become a doctor, dress them as a doctor, as a lawyer, as an engineer, as a footballer, as a pastor, as apostle general, whatever career they want to become. Teach your children in the way they should go. And when they grow, they will never depart from it. It's a prophetic exercise. Parents, please, 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 don't let your child be the only one who comes to church not dressed up. We beg you. In two weeks, so we are giving you two weeks notice. 7th May, 7th May career day at the king service ministry on the same 7th of may is wmg service here at the oil dome this friday at uh, prayer and miracle service we are having visitors from the joy fm corporate worship they are joining us in our service and they are bringing some guests. Uh, they are hiring one of our own emoji. He'll be there to bless us. Celestine Donko will be there. And then Kofi Owusu Pepra will be there as well. It's going to be a wonderful time in the presence of God. 6.30, 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Uh, here at Ahimfie. Prayer and counter service with Joy FM. You want to be there. Prayer and worship. Prayer and worship. Oh, you are going to enjoy yourself. It's going to be a wonderful time. Please invite somebody Friday, Friday at 6 p.m. Foundation School, your orientation is continuing this week. We are preparing for our graduation in May. So make sure if you have finished the classes and you haven't graduated yet, please come on Monday at 6 p.m. at the King David's Temple. And some wonderful men and women of God will be there to facilitate and show you how to finish and graduate and become a full member of Royal House Chapel. Amen. This Friday, um, we are having a powerful all night. April Bonds in collaboration with Wayless Prayer Ministry. April Bonds and Wayless. We said a few weeks ago, every friday this year there is an all night that is going on and we are praying against the spirit of death we are praying for the church members of royals we are praying for the church we are praying for the apostle general we are praying for the premier lady every friday every friday every friday at 10 p.m different groups are leading this these all nights so if you are available mama Rita said in your waiting process you don't stop praying in your waiting process you don't stop praying if you are at home you don't you couldn't make the friday prayer encounter at 6 30 p.m there's an all night available at 10 p.m you cannot miss it you cannot miss it every friday so this friday is april bonds and wayless next friday another group next friday another group next friday until 31st december hello hello is this a good idea so please there is prayer all around you. Uh, um, Amor Bears are praying Wednesday evening. Hour of Champions are praying Wednesday morning. Pillars of Christ are praying Thursday evening. Um, Hour of Champions are praying the first Friday of every month, all night. Uh, morning at the altar, every Saturday morning, 6 a.m. to 8 a.m. Deborah Tree, every Tuesday. Mighty Women, every Wednesday. I mean... You cannot be in a church like this and your prayer life will be dead. It's not possible. It's not possible. Apostle Jonah preached a message. He said, don't die a foolish death. There are some deaths that you, if you die, is a foolish death. I don't want to do second service. So I'll leave it here. Do I have your permission? Every day prayer is going on. Please, 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 please make yourself available. Make yourself available. On the 30th of April, there's a son of the house is organizing a stage folklore play at the National Theater. It's been hosted by, by Prince David Osei. Prince David, please come forward. Let us see you. When I saw the title of the play, I, I thought I was confused. The title of the play is Kosiani Meko. 
is it is that correct? Koshani Meko Anansi story. Oh Anansi reloaded. Koshani Meko. Hey Charlie. It's 30th April is a what it's a Sunday. Sunday evening. There are two shows. One at 5 30 p.m. and the other one is at um, 8 p.m. 5.30 p.m. and 8 p.m. Prince David is the son of the soil. He was raised in Royal House Chapel. Please, let's go and support him at the National Theatre. It's a long time that you went on a date. It's a long time you took your bay and your boo for a date. Please, 30th of April. Take your girlfriend, your boyfriend, your husband, your wife, your fiancé, your fianco. Take them to National Theatre. The tickets are at the information desk, or if you see him after the service, he will sort you out. And I'm sure there's a special discount for royals. Very good. Special discount for royals. Please, information desk. Koshiani Meko, Anansi Reloaded. I, I can't wait for this one. I can't wait for this one. The short code is star 713 star 33 star 90 hash. Um, I'm sure it will come on the screen if you want to purchase a ticket. Amen. Memorial Thanksgiving. Memorial and Thanksgiving. We want to celebrate the lives of the late Mr. Philip Kwame Tete, the father of Philomena Tete of the Royal Ushers Ministry. He was born 